What the hell is this? What's this? Oh, for Nubu. What? Vitaly Soup. It's a what? Is this some food for some hippopotamus or some elephant? Soup. For human being, for human being consumption. For real? No wonder you stink. Now I get where the stench comes from in this house. You eat bitter leaf? Damn girl, you must be bitter down there. And you, Charles, how the hell do you even eat this and survive it? How the hell? What is this? You know what? You need to go out there and get me something tangible for me to eat. Something that looks like me, not like your stupid damn wife. This would be Shut the hell up! Shut up! Shut up! Please call her out. Please, eh? Yes. No, no, oh. No, no. 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 How can I grow old? <laughs> yeah? Even if I'm crazy, why should I grow old? I, well, no, I cannot grow old. Look at this. That is why my son saw something. Yes, she is. Oh. We didn't need. Hey! Come on, will you? Make a nail. You can see our guest. Hmm? They are here because of you. Mm -hmm. They have come to seek for your hand in marriage. Yes. So the question that goes to you. Should I receive them or I should send them away? Papa, with all due respect, send them away. Eh? And continue sending them away till they get to where they are going to. Hey! 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 I told you that I'm not interested in this marriage. Eh? I have somebody that wants to marry me from overseas. Eh? Please, you both should stop this. Papa, stop acting like this. And I told you that I have somebody. Every day you will still be accepting suitors. I don't want to get married. See, by force. I don't want to get married. But I have told you that I have somebody I want to get married. To me. Which of the four is going Amara. 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 Can you see your daughter? Nah. Don't be angry. Nah. Don't be angry. Everything will be all right. Trust me. Mm. Oh, oh, mm. Let me go and talk to her. Oh, mm. sorry. Mm. It's too okay. Better be. Oh, oh. Amara! Amara! What kind of thing is this? Eh? Jimu! Amara, this is the fourth man you just rejected. Very soon, the news will go to the whole village that you reject suitors. Eh? Now, where is that man you so much loved that you've not brought to the family to know? We need to see him. Listen. You are a woman and you don't have much time like men. Does that sink into your head at all? Nemara, talk to your daughter. Talk to your daughter. Let her embrace some senses into her head. She should not force me to marry her out. Amara, you have the time to make the choice now and make a good one for that matter. If not, if not, let me not say the rest. Have you seen it? If you go here, have you seen what you're doing? No problem. So, Badro, you have sworn not to give me peace in my own husband's house. No problem. You don't want to get married. Oh, Mama, why are you talking like this? Ma, is it my fault? Is it my fault that I cannot love any other man except Charles? Is it my fault? It's not my fault. Sometimes I used to try let me know that I want to marry one of these suitors, but I cannot. Something in my mind used to tell me, don't marry them. I love Charles. The love I have for him is not allowing me, Mama. Hey! Mama, why are you talking like as if you do not love Papa? I didn't be the told you to go and marry somebody that you do not love. Will you go? You'll marry Papa because you love him. Now you want me to marry people that do not love him. No, no, Mama. Me, me now, you want me to come marry somebody that, 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 I'm, 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 I'm not in love with you. Let me bring this. You can still love someone else if you open your heart. I'm your mother. I am not going to deceive you. 
Gone are the days when men still remain faithful. Eh? Just have gone far too long for, for you to expect him to come back for you. Even if he does, even if he does come back, he will not accept you. Because he will feel you are no longer his level. Then your, your distance, how do I go now? Eh? Mama. Mama, how am I supposed to start loving someone else now? How? And the child I know will not trade me for anything. I know that. Oh, and how long do you intend to wait for him? Forever. Why don't you choose from this multitude of suitors and settle down? I am your mother. I know what is good for you. I cannot deceive you. We share the same blood. Make him now that is uh, sunshine before change. And when is he getting Eh? Choose amongst them and settle down. Yes, I know that uh, uh, Charles is your first love. But sometimes, first love are not truly the most loved. They still have their commas here and there. My daughter, move on. Move on. Mama, Charles will come back for me. That I am very sure of. The Charles I know will come back for me. The Charles I know will come back for me. When? Maturo Purumpi. When? Say that for you too, man. You don't even look like one of this country. Look at man. We're just trying to look good, bro. I tell you, this country is hot as fuck. You want to know the truth, nigga? You don't look like what you're saying. You look like one who's basic. Damn, man, nigga, you look good, bro. We just don't look like what's of being shit. Good to see right. you, man. Good to see you. Good to see you too, bro. Sit, 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 sit my nigga. Sit, sit my nigga. nigga. Man, bro, ask. You're supposed to come pick me up, bro. Yeah. Call your number, say really. You weren't thinking. Tell me which bitch held your phone. No, <laughs> my bad, bro. I'm sorry about that. But trust oh, me, man. No man. bitch got me. Damn, yeah, <laughs> bitches. Cause you always been like that since school days. Come on, man. I know you. Yo, bro, you you, you talk to me like that. I'm not like that no more, I man. Changed. Yeah, I'm a change, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good now, bro. Trust All me. Right, yeah. Good to see you, man. Good, good to see you too. <laughs> oh, yeah, Kev, wonderful. Kev, Kev, Kev. You just won't change. Ah. Uh. <laughs> So what's up, bro? I'm good, I'm good, you know. Just just go back looking around, man. I see that, I see yeah. that, man. The, the, the shoes look so oh, good. Come on, it's Doys and Gibani 2022 moment. That, believe that. <laughs> bro, uh, all right, it's good. So you got plans to go to the village? Uh, yes, I do. But first of all, I'm going to check into a hotel, you know, try to cool my hair down. But the first place I'm coming since I left the airport, man. Then secondly, um, get a place, you know, and try and see if I can acquire a house, you know. Cool. And then afterwards, all roll lace to the village to go pick a man and then they come back to the city to live with me. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna settle down with Tamara. Damn, bro. You serious about this? Of course, I'm dead serious about it. Damn. What do you mean, damn? Like, you want to tell me you travel around the world and back? What's your present status and all you can think about as one local girl hey, will get married to? Hey, 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 Kev, please. Damn. I'm gonna have a personal problem with you if you try to call me a local girl again. What are you talking about, man? When I was back in the village, no girl looked at me, including those city girls you talk about. They all called me Chingon Boyfriend, you remember? And now the only woman who stood by me, Amara, gave me all the support, all the love, push, most importantly, prayer. She told me that I'll go and come back in success. Now I'm a success. You want me to go back to those bush ones, those <laughs> Rottweilers you call city girls? Come on, man. I can't do that. I'm around all the way. And please, you should start getting ready, man. Of course, you know, no other person is going to be my best friend, if not you. 
Nigga, you serious about this? Sign and seal, man. It's Amara all the way. It's Amara or no one else. Hold up, hold up, bro. Hold up, bro. Listen. There are lots of things this girl can do for you. Like exposure. Oh, Hello? Man. This girl's gonna fuck you up in public. She's gonna embarrass you, bro. Trust me, you're not gonna like it. How do you think I went abroad? Through things. Wealth and exposure. And I have all of that now. So what do I do? I give it back to the woman that supported me to travel. Nigga, you're serious about that. Oh, come on, man. You should stop saying this serious thing. I am dead serious. Fine, man. I got your back. Aha. Uh -huh. So you should start thinking of how you're gonna follow me to go pay her dowry. My nigga, serious to sell it down. Bro, 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 my nigga. <laughs> Yo, let me hook you something, man. I got some bad. Uh, let's yeah. not go in there. Let's go out there. Out there? Out there. Yo, nigga, I need to look good. Alright, you go clean up. Go I need to up. look good. Go my clean nigga. Up right here. I'm right back, bro. All right, all right. <laughs> and don't I'm forget, right back, bro. Don't forget your ATM card. Uh, <laughs> yeah, nigga. you said. You we got exchanges, man. We're going to exchange your dollars. No, you got pounds. I know you got pounds. Oh, right. nigga, no. nigga, I don't have to spend my pounds now. Get your. Do you still do this thing you do back in school? Put the whole bills on me? Nigga. Mama! 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 Mama, tell me back. Is it true? Yeah! <laughs> he said he wants to marry me. He came back because of me to marry me. <laughs> Mama, I told you. I told you he was going to come back for me. I told you. Asma, I know what I'm doing. I'm going to go to the You were patient on his back. Yes, yeah, Now I'm happy. Eh? I'm beginning to think that uh, my enemies are at work at, against me. Eh? The evil doers, they want to succeed against me. Because you know you practically rejected all the young men that came to ask for your hand in marriage. All because of this singular chance. Eh? I told you there could be other chances around. But you said no, it was just that singular one. Mm -hmm. It's the only chance, Mama, because I love him so much. And now he's back. He's here to come and marry me. You're so happy. I'm so happy, Mama. <laughs> but, Mama, what again? Do you think after everything, Papa is going to accept him? Why not? Charles is a good man. He's well to do. And he's from a very wonderful family background. That is part of the fact. Your father and I, we all wanted you to marry a man that will take care of you. We don't care whether it is this Charles or another child that is involved. It could be Bennett, it could be Ben, it could be other Charles. We don't care. But the man that will love you and take care of you. <laughs> I'm so happy. Um, that means if Papa comes back, I'll tell him. Yes! Hi! <laughs> Little is sitting in my hand. I'm happy. Sorry, I'm not so happy. It's your mother, my very good friend. Mm. Our coming to your house today is for something very, very important. Mm. As a matter of fact, is she a silence? I am very surprised seeing all these things before me. Eh? When I know that we are not celebrating any occasion. You are right, my friend. You know, our people used to say that a toad does not run in the daytime for nothing. Yes. Either it's after something or something is after something it. Something is after it, yes. I know you might be wondering, but it is all for good. You see, my son here, Okay, the chamber. Open up this year. It's a hand oh, Already made. Already made. <laughs> yes. You see, he said he saw a very beautiful flower in your compound. Mm. And uh, he, he will be pleased if you can allow us to block it. And that is why I've come with my, my brother here, Ichi Nzado. So, what do I have to say? Hmm. Ichi Silas, beautiful flower in my compound. I'm sorry, I am uh, I am not a gardener. <laughs> <laughs> like the, the, the truth must be said. I am at a loss because I don't know where exactly you are heading to. Ichi Amadi, mm -hmm. our son here, Charles, mm -hmm. is interested in marrying your daughter, Amara. Mm -hmm. That is the reason we are here. Okay. Hope we are welcomed. 
Oh, 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 oh. Very good. Now that you have spoken in a plain language that I understand, now I believe that you have come with good intent. Yes. You are welcome. Thank you. <laughs> My good friend, mm. thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you, Ichi Amadi. You're welcome. Oh mm. uh, <laughs> but before I proceed, hmm, I cannot take a unilateral decision. I need to call my daughter hmm, and hear from her. Uh, Mara. Nia Mara. Hi. Uh -huh, please. Bring Amara. <laughs> Call Amara to come. Let her come and see our guests. Oh, <clears throat> nice. Uh -huh. You are welcome. Thank you. Yeah. I, she will soon be here. <laughs> But the truth is that you cannot shave somebody's head in, his, in the person's Mine. absence. Yes. <laughs> Here we are. <laughs> you are welcome. None, oh. None. Amara. Papa. We are seeing these able bodied men sitting down here. Hmm? They are here for your sake. They have come to ask for your hand in marriage. Hmm? But I cannot decide yes or no until I hear from you. So, I am asking you now. Should I accept them or I should send them away and send them away and send them away? Papa, hmm? with all due respect, hmm? continue to send them in. <laughs> 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 Hey, we are in already. We are in. <laughs> oh, continue to send them in. Yes, send them in. Yes. Send them in. Now, now, no, no. I send down the in. We send down the in. Oh, 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 oh. Let me see you in the garagan. Eh? Eh, Ngwa Amara, share everything. Give them drink. Let them drink the garden egg and everything. Okay. Just like that. Ah, well, why you're not blowing this year? Well, why you? Well, why you? Blowing this year? Blowing this year? I'm not going to sit here to wait, man. Ah, ah, okay. Just because you're my good one. Can you see? Can you see? Come on, let me see. Man, I get a bit on my foot. I get a bit on my foot. I get a bit on my foot. So Charles, you have the guts to come back to Nigeria and get married to another woman. <clears throat> Honestly, when I had the news, I, I was surprised myself. <laughs> you know, you forgot that I made you and I can also destroy you. You, you want to bite the hands that actually fed you, right? Just wait until I see you. Then you will feel the rage of a bitter woman. Babe, take it easy. You, you need to calm down. What has happened has happened. Please, I don't want you to allow this to disorganize you. Okay? Charles has a good taste. Aren't you going to close your gate? Leave this gate. I like and like this. Leave him. Never answer me. Who are you? And where are you going with this big box? Well, my name is Sandra. I am the UK Queen. Hmm? I am Charles's wife. I am back home and I'm here to stay. Do you have a problem with that? With Charles? I understand that most of the apes in this country understand is money. Well, 
Sugar pie. What are you doing here? Is that the best way to welcome you? I wife? ask you a question. What are you doing here? Hmm. Honey, who is she? Sweetheart, you don't have to worry your head about her. It's just a nobody. A what? Excuse me, what did you just address me as? You know what? You are nothing but a slimy, demented, retarded idiot. What? An imp. You are the ghost to eat my money. Come back here, get married to this retarded. This, this, this what? And you are telling her I'm a nobody? You are sick in the head. You're going to do me a favor. You shut that tunnel in your face. I won't. And I can't. And as for you, you better say you decrease. You better something to the boy for head, Abby. You're mad. You the bugger, eh? Now me, they ask him, say who I be? Because I never got something to whack your head, Nabi. You the crazy. Listen to me, I don't know what this man told you. But what in a second, this is my husband's house. This is my house. Honey, you don't belong here. What's she talking about? She's, is she saying she's going to break my head? No, I'm going to break your damn nose. I will so break your nose. Shut up. Honey, don't worry, honey. Explain everything to you. She's yeah. just a loser. Ah, oh, of course I am a loser. But let me tell you something. Let's know who is a loser. It's either you move your things to the guest house, better still, the get my house, because that's where you belong. Else, I will so whoop your tacky, wacky ass off this house, and I have to do it. He knows me. Oh, oh please! Babe. Babe! What's that stage? What was that stage? Well, I, I'm trying. You know, I can't believe you moved from, from this to, to that. You're going to shut up. I won't. Just I... tell her to get some cement for her intimacy. I mean, her vagina stains. Damn, what was that? Do you have some air freshener? Oh, I got a perfume. I got some good perfumes from UK. Trust me, it will make the house smell very nice. I'm not married to her. What we had was contract marriage and it ended a long time ago. Contract marriage? Yes. So you were one of those boys that travel abroad, get married to someone there, come back down here and get married to another, right? No. That's not how it works. There's a reason we do these things over there. 
just to have resident permit and to, to do your business freely without the interference of the police. It was strictly contract. No feelings attached. So my love, I need you to stay calm. You see that girl down there? I'll sort her out immediately. You have nothing to fear. Absolutely nothing. You stop crying. <laughs> you love it. <laughs> so nice. Yeah. Oh, good morning. How was the night? Shoot your teeth. It sucks. What the hell is this? What's this? What? Bitterly soup. Bitter what? Is there some food for some hippopotamus or some elephant? For human being, for human being consumption. For real? No wonder you stink. Now I get where the stench comes from in this house. You eat bitter leaf? Damn girl, you must be bitter down there. And you chaps, how the hell do you even eat this and survive it? How the hell? What is this? You know what? You need to go out there, get me something tangible for me to eat. Something that looks like me, not like your stupid damn wife. This would be Shut the hell up! Shut the hell up! Rubbish! Beat up my boots. Stop it!
What is the meaning of this? I am still watching the movie. Sorry, are you talking to me? No, are you actually talking to me? Yes, it's you I'm talking to. Then you must be sick at the head. You were right sick from your mother's womb. You are sick. Now look at you. You actually... Now let me ask you. I mean, when was you use a proper toothpaste for your set of teeth? Now you tell me. So you think... No, you don't know it's the It stinks. Hello? You can hear it from, I mean, five meters away from wherever you are. It stinks. And then secondly, where you come from, do you guys have light? Because from your hair, girl, to your toe, you look rumpled. It shows in your life. You look so rumpled. So because you think you came into this house and then they kept some plasma TV for you, which is my own money, you now think you have the right, the gods, the temerity to talk about me. Have you gone for us? Why you take your pedicure self out of my sight this moment? Go! Listen, 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 please. I do not want to move further than this. What, I mean, what do you guys want to tell? I mean, you actually brought your friend to come talk to me over what? Can you just give us one minute, all right? I, 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 it's not like I brought him here to insult you or anything, but I brought him here so he could talk to you because you This visit is costing me more harm than good. Yes. Really? Bring a full grown man to me. You brought someone who looks unsatisfied with life. With some stupid hardship hair tie, you look like some hardship idiot. Now you tell me, listen to me, Mr. Man, I don't care where I don't care where you're from, I don't care why you're here. But no matter what you say, I am not going to leave your friend. You know why? Because he is mine. I've spent a whole lot of money on him for him to become mine, and that's it. Well, listen. You had a contract marriage with my friend. Guess what? It's done. Now I want you to name your price. Huh? And you think you can afford me? Of course not, can. Really? <laughs> well, you cannot afford me. Secondly, I am not leaving you. Do you understand that? And you take your stupid self with your stupid high tire with your hands. Get out. Sunday. Get your face off me. Stupid. What? Bro, is this, is this what, what you have in there? No, this happened right in front of you. Now, you see the Rottweiler that I've been nursing in my house? Bro, this is more than what Rottweiler, man. This is a full-grown King Kong. There's nothing I haven't done to make peace with this girl. It just won't work. Oh, come on, bro, bro. Oh, I'm so sorry about this, man. You're uh, you, fucked up. You, you know, look, just imagine that I had taken your advice. Marry a city girl. What do you think my house would be now? Iraq? Iran? Boko Haram? On gun, no men. On men, no gun. Man, if this was my house, I will be long gone. Long gone so that she could divorce my wife. No. Uh, talking about your wife, how is she taking this? Oh, you know, my wife is on a quiet side. She's not speaking much. Bro, you fucked up. Real fucked up. Damn. Hey, Emma. Hey. How are you? Kevin, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Welcome. Thank you very much, huh? Uh, can oh. sit. Um. That wouldn't be necessary. How about um, Charles? Uh, he got a call and left immediately. Oh, too bad. That means I have to reschedule my appointment with him. Hmm? Okay, but just please, just sit down. Let me give you something. Don't worry about that. I'm fine. I'll, I'm, I'll have to leave now. Okay? Are you, are you sure? Yes, I'm fine. I don't want to take anything. Like maybe I'm one. good. I'm, I take care. Not so fast. Hi, Sandra. I really like to have a discussion with you. So what is it you wanted us to discuss? You came the other day to talk to me with your friend, right? Oh, yes, I did. Nice. And you refused to talk to us. So what's up? Are you ready to name your price? You think it's actually about the price, right? No. You know, 
I... I actually think I... I like you. I think we can do a whole lot together. I mean, I think I like your dealings. Mm -hmm. Trust me, you have a whole lot to gain. So what do you mean by... You like my dealings? I saw you in the club last night. You were everywhere. I loved your dealings. Do you know that guy? <laughs> Who does not know him? He is the hottest and most dangerous guy in town. Everybody knows him. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Do you know, I, his face is familiar. I, I think I've met him before. It, I think he's Charles' friend. Oh, really? I mean, did you see the I mean, he's doing it. Then draw him close and use him. <sighs> What's a friend? That's the only thing that can come into your work here. Let's go back. Let's go to one at night. <laughs>
So now you see what I am talking about. You see? I know you more than your friend. All right, fine. I accept the fact you know me more than my friend. Mm -hmm. I do. So what's up? Stick with me. Be my partner. Support me. I mean, that's all I need from you. Like I said, you have a whole lot to gain. I take it that your silence means that we have mutual understanding. <laughs> what could they be discussing? Why is it that this Sandra of a girl is having influence over everyone? Who is she? Look at the way she just stops Kevin from proceeding to go out. This is serious. What are they even discussing? I'm sorry. I, I, I'm sorry. 
She slaps me. of agreements you and I have, one that I'm not aware of? Is there anything attached to the agreement? Talk to me! You're pushing me. You are testing my patience. It seems you forgot that your downfall is just phone call away. Get the father behind me. transaction in the last deal with it. Why haven't I gotten my payment? I asked the question. Why haven't I gotten my payment? You gotta cool down. I should do what? You gotta cool down, right? I'm cool already. You said the guys we did business with, they had a little showdown with cash. But I believe before the end of the day, we should have our money. Well, there's a new deal. There's this particular laboratory that I need to supply stuff to. And the information getting to me is that he likes girls. So I want two hot smoking girls. That is the only way we'll be able to supply. And then you follow up for payment. Do we have a deal? Sounds like a good deal. We got this one. Waiter, let me have some champion please. I already told you, I'll give it to you. I will, I promise. I give you my word. Oh, babe, I'm sorry. Okay, I'll call you back. Let's go. Babe, what is this game you're playing with Kelvin and his friend? I'm not playing any game. I'm just doing business with them. Besides, I'm getting a good digging from Spray. Okay, just be very careful. I don't trust Kelvin. Kelvin? He wouldn't even dare to do any rubbish near me. I mean, he knows the kind of person he's going to be messing with. All I'm concerned is you getting your child's back, not this game you're playing with them. Trust me, it is fun. <sighs> and don't you forget to add, it is also dangerous. It is not. Don't worry, babe, I can handle everything. By the way, his friend is so good in bed. 
Let's go. Bad girl. You need to try him more. <laughs> Yo, homie. You gone down with that, babe? You already know what it is, bro. The only thing Fran cares about is the money and the good sex. No strings attached, bro. Just... You know how I like it, so... I'll give her what she wants. She gives me what I want. I have my relationship. I need to concentrate on that. So, no strings attached. I don't want anybody growing feelings. No feelings, bro. Oh, yeah, I feel you. I feel you, bro. I'm made of the streets. So, no feelings, bro. I feel you, bro. Did you actually touch my phone with your uncultured infested disinfect? Did you just touch my phone? Yeah, I, I was cleaning here. I said, let me just push it to this phone. Me... You touched my phone? Yes, let me. You want to do what? Oh, you want to put my phone? Yes. You were trying to what? You were trying to what? Ah, no, tell me what you tried to do. You were trying to do what? Idiot. Look at her. Look how millipede. You had the guts to touch my phone. If not for one thing, I would have beaten the living daylight out of you. And I will stop with this! Telling me that Amara lost her pregnancy all because of Sandra. Yes. She was fine, man. I just went down the road to get groceries for her, and before I came back, they already had a fight. And that was it. You know, I think you should get them out of that house. Real fast. That's exactly what I'll do as soon as my wife recovers. Yeah, bro, you need to do that real fast. You need to get her out of that fucking house, I swear to God. Else she's going to kill her. I know this, I've seen the movies, man. She's going to fucking kill her. Sandra. It's alright, bro. It's alright, bro. Alright? It's alright. Put yourself together. Hmm? Thank 
you. It's all right. Sorry for everything. Is there anything you want? Which I can provide it. You... You want fruit salad? is killing me. Can you see something? I'm sorry. You know, if I were you, I wouldn't be hating the dining this way. Because even your entire generation put together cannot afford it. And I was told that you lost that defamed half human being you had in your tummy. Oh, I'm so sorry. Was it painful? Did it hurt? Was the blood too much? Oh, I get it. You know what? If I were you, I would pack up my things and leave this house. Listen, if you do not leave this house, <laughs> I will pick your nose hairs. One, I will twist it up with a tweezer, one after the other. Ooh, who's sitting behind telling me? I will kill him. So you have two options live or die. What she said is true. That she will kill me and Chas is not going to do anything about it. What am I even saying? I think all she said is true. Charles did not do anything meaningful when I lost my pregnancy. What if I had died? Hmm. No. I cannot take this anymore. I would not. I need to let Mama and Papa know about this. I need to start packing up my things. Hey! Why go on and die, Fifia? 
I am lost in everything. I don't even know if Charles is telling the truth. He told me that he's no longer married to her. But she's still living with us. And she's busy tormenting me and Charles. And Charles is doing nothing about it. He's not even saying it. All he keeps telling me is, calm down, don't talk. Calm down and do what? Eh? Does he know how it feels for one to go through this kind of pain you're going through? No woman on this planet, earth and above, has the right to make my daughter go through what you're going through now. He, she cannot chase you out of your husband's house. Unless my own man, my own man, my own man, What is that? Yes. Why do you talk like this? Listen to me, all you need to do is just tell me when you're right. I will give you the real cocoa. I will give you real good stuff. You know me, you know how I am. You can see that again, the queen of your king. I will give you the best stuff. Okay, I'll, I'll call you back. Thank you. Did you... Did you see Amara going off? I said, did you see Amara... Since when did that start? I don't understand. Am I now her guard, her guardian angel? Why would you reduce me to that, 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 that extent? Why do I have to look over someone who has never gone for a spa treatment all her life? Please. I'm not picking. Really? You're yeah, welcome. Jazz! When you came to marry my daughter, you didn't tell me your intention was to kill her. Can my child let me finish talking? I'm talking. Mama, Mama, no, no. Can you give the phone to, to Amma? Let me explain. Mama, hello? Do all the rubbish. But now when I set my feet into that city, my one you know, could you okay, man? I will show you both the stuff I am made of. Mama, mama, no, it hasn't, it hasn't gotten to that. Uh, mama, I can explain. Look, hello, hello, mama. Shut up! I'm not you. I am not you. Yes, you heard me. I am coming. Rubbish. Oh, because of your attitude. Take! Papi me here. Now you saw the baby and baby wa. Just cry to solve any problem. They just see you as if you're a coward. And that is what you are. Did you hear Nonsense. This is as of right. He's your husband. He's your husband. Have you seen what you've cost? Have you seen what you've cost? What is it? What? What did I do? No, you tell me what? What is it? In my lips. No matter what you do, how you do, no matter how hard you push me, Never marry you. And who won't take to? I'm just managing you. Stop crying. 
You don't have to keep crying. I'm here now. Wipe your tears. I have to follow you back to that house. Yes. I won't wait for your father to come back from his journey. You know he went for, um, for he went to his maternal home for funeral. I will follow you back to the house. Let me see who will stand me. I will show that idiot. When that idiot accost me, she will testify that Madame Genica has arrived. Mama, I understand, but please, I honestly do not want any trouble. I want the trouble. You see, trouble. My other name is Trouble. I'm just pain that you're telling me this, this late now, when you have lost the baby already. If you had told me from the beginning, all these things would not have happened. By now, she should have been in her grave or back to wherever she came from. It's okay. Mm. All right? It's okay. Mm. You have me. You have me. Oh, you want me mad. You have me. Marriage is not easy, oh, mama. Marriage it's, is not easy. It's, that marriage is, as you make your bed, that is how you lie on it. If you want your marriage to prevail and strive, it will. If you want your marriage to collapse, it definitely people are out there to make it collapse. Help you make it collapse. So stand firm. Only what I bought. But this place is so cool. I I love the way Charles arranged this place. He has this for good things. You can say that again. I mean, that's why I went for him. Mm. So, um, where is your co-wife? That one? <laughs> well, I've not seen her for the past two days. I guess she's gone. That reminds me. She should be in the village because she has nobody in the city. That look at me. Wow. So you've got this house to yourself. Goodness. I trust you. There is nothing you're not oh. capable of getting. What about Charles? Has he had anything to do with you since you got into the country? I mean, anything intimate? Well, not at all. You know, he's been avoiding me, seriously. And he's beginning to bother me. But this is the only chance you have now that his wife is away. Try get him to do something with you. Drug him. Get him to get intimate with you. No, you're making sense. I'll do that. I will. Just try and pin him down. You should know what I mean. Of course I do. Bad girl. <laughs> Thank you for your two cents advice, anyways. You're welcome. Hey, maybe you should try some. No, I'm fine. I'm, I'm fine. Thank you. I won't have it. I, I, I love you know, you actually need this. No, I think I'm fine. You should take it once in a while. That way you'll be able to fall in love, you know. Mm -mm. I don't want to fall in love. Please, still, this is my husband. Uh oh. I prefer money than falling in love. You go. Yeah, you know, no, no, let's say, you see, we discussed about something. Uh, what she was supposed to do? She's the one. She is the one that's been giving me problems in my husband's house for not seeing her. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you're the one the devil has sent? Yes. To come and destroy my daughter's life in her married her home? Sorry, did you just touch me with those wrinkled Richard hands of yours? Eh? I mean, the same, the same hands you used to cultivate your stupid cocoa in the village. Did you just touch me with it? Oh, my that's how she is. Oh, my mother can say, but they're okay. I'm coming. Wait, wait, did you actually go to break? I brought You brought this thing to yes. fight for you? Yes, that's my mother. You guys are crazy. Yes. Eh? So you're calling my mother crazy? I was saying. You're calling my mother this crazy? You're calling my mother crazy? Ah! 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 Mama, you might go! Mama! 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 Today, she will have, she will not 
I've been able to leave to tell the story. Mama. Because in Caribe, in my, in my car, that kind of mark your people carry on their faces. That was a za, 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 za. Mama, this old Yubo rats ran. This girl ran. No, that, that I'm not wrong. This girl ran. I came prepared, equipped. Two bottles in my box. Ah! Mama. You don't know your mother. It's Bulana. Where I am. Eh? Seem just like you are not welcome. You can as well leave. Mm. I mean, it's obvious. <laughs> it is obvious to me that you planned all this. But let me tell you something that you're not even remembering. I mean, not even remembering time soon. You would want to pay for their sins. That's a promise. But you do what I mean. So, she went to bring her mother to fight for her. My dear, she even had the court, I mean the form of court, to even remain, I mean to still stay in that house. You need to have seen her. And what is Charles doing about this? Hmm. Hmm. Charles. Well, I guess he's probably happy because he hasn't said anything meaningful since then. Of course. He won't say anything, but babe, you have to do everything possible to make Charles take down one out of the house. Of course he has to. I mean, I have to make him, I have to persuade him. Oh, I can't stay one more day in that house with that woman, trust me. I can't. It's choking me. <laughs> hey! Oh, wow. <laughs> Mama! <laughs> 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 you are this your Igbo channel. Uh uh. <laughs> Forget it. This one is very interesting. As a yard. If you got a bad habit, I could go. Mama, your food is ready. I'm not going to go. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Do I remind you? I saw you cleaning that useless girl's room this morning. Why? Huh? Nothing, Mama. Nothing, Mama? Hmm. They just ask you to do that. Mama, it's for peace to you. Hey! Who's peace? If you like, clean that room from now till eternity. There will be no peace. Do you think you just get peace like that? Listen, you fight and get peace. Peace does not come to you just on its own. You fight for it. I don't know if Charles' intention was to bring you to this house and turn you into a boy boy. Housemaid in his house. That one will never happen again. I am here now. I am in charge. I'm a man. And if you ever in your entire life, do that again. You will not like what I will do to you. But, Mama. But what? Just shut up. And I bring you up. Give me a brought over you down. Are you mad? Huh? In your own husband's house. Get your boy boy. 
Why don't they scoop soup from you from the side of the pot? I've been asking for a part of a tea again and said, Give me any. In a pala. Eh? What does she have that you do not have? Eh? You're even more, in fact, you're even more, more endowed. Let me hear you look like you're occupied. Listen, occupy, sit down and occupy. What did I say? Occupy. Yes! Occupy! You would allow that girl to rule over you. Or oh, one blow, she would turn red. And that is a sign of winning. Yes! Don't worry. I am here to give you peace. To make you occupy. She will not do anything. I am her match. In every way, her match. What is that? What is that? Thank you, Mama. Mama, don't worry. I'm coming. Now let me finish this program. I'm coming. Thank you, Mama. Let me finish this one. Let's go. Don't let me go see him. Got some meat. Are you actually eating? No, you are eating. Now you tell me why is my breakfast not served in my room? Excuse me. Are you my what? Because you're wearing this mask. Hey! 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 Are you stupid? You are crazy. How dare you? How dare you? Eh? That's How? How dare you touch Oh, this is what this is all about. Yes. Really? Because you've got your mother right. Don't you dare touch her again, else I will teach you a lesson you will never forget. Really? Before. If I am not going to eat in this house, then no one should. I was expecting you to hit her so that, eh? If I hit her, what will happen? If I hit her, Mama, Mama, see, I'm affecting you now. I'm affecting you. Mama, 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 <laughs> you look good. Thank you, babe. Come here. So tell me, how did it go? Everything went perfectly well, baby. Don't you trust me? I trust you. That's my baby. <laughs> Come here. Mm -hmm. All right, babe. So he paid in cash and he confirmed that the stuff is really good. And he wants us to do constant supply for him. That won't be a problem. I trust you, baby. <laughs> we'll definitely supply him. You know, we're the surest plug in town. For sure, baby. <laughs> <laughs> so, as long as he's paying good money, we'll give him good stuff. Alright, babe. So, there's something I want us to talk about. Babe. Don't you think we should get a better life? I mean, we have enough money to take care of ourselves. Let's travel out of this country. Start up something legit. Come on, babe. I know you do it for me, please. I really want us to get into something better, something legit, a better life. You know I love you. Yes, baby, I do. I know you love me so much. 
And that's why I want to make you the woman of my life. Because you think exactly the way I am thinking. Thanks, baby. No, not every woman will think what you just thought right now. As a matter of fact, I'm already making preparations for us to travel abroad. Thank you so much, babe. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Anything for you? You know, calling you the love of my life, it's not enough. I oh. love you so much, baby. <laughs> I love Thank you too. Thank you so much. I love you. I love you too. Check this uh, channel, to Ibo channel. I want to watch Ibo movie. Okay. You dare not! Are you stupid? I mean, I know you're stupid. Are you that dumb? And as for you, old woman, I can understand that you're aged. But being blind is something that I was not expecting from you. Not with a grey hair. I mean, not without a grey hair. Listen to me. If you try to change this channel, the changing, I'm major kante. I will slap and slap the mother out of you and your mother. Who is blind? Blind witches. Who is blind? You head. Who is blind? Oh! It is your blind. Mama, ah, 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 ah. Mama, please don't kill her. Mama, I'm happy. 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 Mama, I'm Mama, I'm going to go to the house. Hey, Mama, you see that place? Sit, sit. Sit on that her phone. Mama, you are strong. You think I'm you? Hey, you think I'm you? Mama, you're not going to go to the house. Mama, you're not going to go to the house. You're not going to go to the house. You're not going to go to the house. Just get out. I do not want to talk to you. Get out. I just want to say sorry. Sorry for how my mother in law treated you. Exactly what I was expecting you to say. I mean, the way you talk so well about your mother in law, yes, she is smart with me, and you cannot even say a word. Listen to me. You better make that woman to go. If she does not go, <laughs> you know what is at stake, right? I will so make her back like some Canadian Rottweiler. That's a promise! I'm sorry. Shut up! Where is some wine and some transparent photosynthesis? Meanwhile, you're black. Like some imp. I need you to know. I said shut up. I'm losing it. Thank you. You're welcome. You really You're just one phone call away. I don't think you realize that. I do. Thank you. Can I? Can I go now? Just shut up. Hmm? Uh, it's like Chinese. Uh, no, they used to call it Brazilian hair. Eh? Hey! <laughs> My enemies will see that they'll be rolling on the ground, rolling on the ground, rolling on the ground. Mama, you are an enemy. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. I don't you know women are very jealous. When I had you, everybody, why did she have a boy? Uh -huh. Yes! <laughs> Mama, this one, do you like this one? This is my color. Look at this girl. What are you doing here? Huh? I thought you have moved on. Rather, you are here trying to snatch other people's husband. When husband says he does not want you, all you need to do is to go away. Are you a thief? You're crazy. Hmm? As a matter of fact, you sit in the head. I can understand that the cassava you've been fed with all the while in the village is beginning to affect your memory cells. Are you listening to me? You think you've got the guts to come fight for your daughter and lay your future hands on me? I guess you were not really tutored about the Queen of UK. Nobody fucking dares me. You don't get it? No. If you don't get it, you forget it. 
You don't talk to me like that. Oh, 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 Mama. Have you forgotten what I did to you the last time? Mama, remind her. You know she used to have this memory loss. Remind her. Now maybe she has forgotten how you dealt with her. This girl, remind you want her. me to commit murder? If you don't live here now, what I will do to you, two ambulances will come and carry you. Come on, bring it. Yes! Ambulances. Mama, 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 you know, I'm, I, you look like me. You're like my daughter. I'm one more. One way to know be one more because, Excuse you know. Me? Excuse me? No, you tell me, does you look like I'm being fed with goat meat all my life? Mm -mm, mm -mm. I ain't eating that shit. Now you face the fucking wall. We are sorry. Yes. The wall. Mm -hmm. The wall. We are not seeing the wall. We are not seeing the wall. To the door. 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 To I am moving it already. It's we are moving it. Hey, okay, my name is Now you take care of that. Hey, 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 Listen to me, I am going to give you a very simple instruction. I'm going to make this very easy for you. That is if you are obedient. I just will be obedient. Shut up! Come on, up to now, you cannot even get brush your teeth with a better toothpaste. By the way, you need to go up there, pack your wacky tacky clothes, take your wacky ass out of this place right now. Ten minutes and your time starts now. Get up! Okay. I'm going to do it! Nobody messes with the UK winner. Have you? Finally, <laughs> the cat is back to its house. You know, if I were you, I wouldn't be making those calls. Like I said, those calls are not important. You know why? I mean, were you expecting them to pick your calls from hell? Who the hell takes a call from hell, please? Come on. Oh, okay. 
Why you're gonna be facing me? Come on. Hmm. What are you doing here? And where is my family? <laughs> the voice. <laughs> you see, I actually sent your family, I mean, your wife, back to where they belong. See, so your, your, your mother in law thinks she, she can lay her filthy hands on me and then go scot free. I guess no one too told her about, I mean, she was not, she was not told. I understand the fact that she was not told about the Queen of UK. But I am so going to cut her hands in pieces. So, they're gone. What have you done? I'll wait to bring you upstairs. Same shit every day. So what the fuck are you going to do now? I wish I knew the answer to that question. The right question is, what am I going to tell my kinsman? Man, you should thank God she only succeeded in chasing him out. No one got hurt. Huh? You should thank God, bro. She chased them with a gun. Fuck! Bitch got a gun? Yeah, she's got a gun. Yo, my nigga. That shit is serious. Oh, come on, bro. You should have fixed this a long time ago. If you done the needful, I don't think this shit will be happening, man. What the fuck? Okay. You have no idea who Sandra is. You don't know Sandra. Fuck shit, I know who Sandra is. She's a fucking bitch. Yeah. I know you're scared of her. You're scared she's gonna fuck shit up. You're fucking scared she's gonna fuck all the shit you put together all these years long. Up! My nigga, you got a man up. If this shit was back in the States, my nigga, I'm gonna fuck shit up. Believe that. Can I give you an expo? What's that supposed to mean, bro? Sandra... <laughs> Sandra is way too dangerous than you think. Nah, my nigga. Sandra is a fucking bitch. She ain't dangerous, bro. Back in the projects, bro, we should dance for a living. What the fuck you think she is? Not exactly why you came back home. She dance for a living. You got deported and... You back home, so shut up, man. Yo, my nigga. If it was back in the States, man, I'd put her in a place, man. What the fuck? A bitch got a gun in my house? Man, i fuck you up. What the fuck is that? Can I ain't got no time for that bullshit, my nigga. But can I just... breathe without you saying a whole lot of... Fuck, fuck, fuck. Please. You gotta deal with it, bro. That's my shit. Deal with it. I think I'm sorry for you, man. I think you need a whole lot of joints. Gee, you go through a lot of shit every day, bro. What the hell you deal with it? Ah, oh, fuck. I wish you were the one in my shoes. I'm sure, fuck, fuck. Wow, wow, wow. You see what I told you? Help me with us. I am now in charge of all... I mean, the house. I'm the only one here. I trust you. Welcome to my paradise. Thank you. Thank you. 
So go. You ready? <laughs> okay, so. Game is Charles playing. First of all, choose me. <laughs> well, I don't care. I don't know what game is playing, but whatever he's doing, I'm sure I'm going to be to that. So, who cares? Well, I trust you. Is this house not boring to you? Let's go out and have fun. Excuse me. Please, I ain't going anywhere. I mean, not when Frank is telling my emotions. You want this, Frank? Find someone else. You know, let's go to the club. You might meet a guy there. Excuse me. No, why do you always like reducing yourself to the point that someone thinks that a farmer is your father? No, why do you keep doing it? Why do I want to be picked up as a club girl? I can't do that. I can't reduce myself to that stupor. It's that point. Okay. I just want to be left alone. Thank you. I should just enjoy my champagne. Great. So tell me, what do you want to ask? Roasted barbecue? With the side goes slow. I just want to go out. And I don't want to go out. You should be able to read and understand the handwriting on the wall. I am no longer interested in us. Excuse me? <laughs> you can't be serious, are you? I am very serious. No, you can't. I was the one who initiated this relationship. And I should be the one to say whether I am done with you, not the other way around. Do you even realize what I'm... I mean, I'm capable of doing to What you? are you capable of doing? Do I look scared of you? You think you can threaten me just like that? That's not possible. Okay? Are you walking <laughs> No, you you dare not. Are you walking out on me? Watch me. And if you stay there, I will hit you. Frank! 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 Frank, I am talking to you! Are you sure you're alright? No, I'm fine. I'm just feeling a little feverish. I think I have fever. Maybe. Maybe on my way back, I'll buy you some drugs. It's okay, I'm coming. and lie down now. Let me quickly talk to your father so that we can take you to the clinic. Oh, mom. Are you 
sure you're not pregnant. Mm -hmm. Hmm? I don't know. I just feel terrible inside. Like, my whole system, everything is just like it's not me that is the owner. I think it's for somebody else. My body is not, it's not my own for now. Uh, uh, Sorry. Yes, Mama. Get up, let's go inside. Hmm? Let's go inside, let's go inside. No, Mama, no energy. No energy, Mama. Hello, sir. Thank you very much. I received the money you sent. I really appreciate, sir. I hope they treated you well, sir. You know, I'll always send you the best. Yes, I select the best. Forget your birthday. No, 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 no. I, I can't forget your birthday, sir. That is why I reserved myself for you that day. Yes, I'll be all yours tonight. Nah, you don't have to worry about anything, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Bye. <laughs> mm. Okay. <laughs> Let us take her to the hospital eh, to find out if she's pregnant or not. So that we'll know what next step to take. My, hmm? I know what I'm saying. I am a woman. And I know when someone is pregnant. Remember, I've been pregnant before. Yes. And lately, I've been noticing some changes in her. And those are signs of pregnancy. Hmm. Yes. It's all right. But I still insist we we'll take her to the hospital. Hmm? No problem. Let us find out if she's pregnant. She might need some medication. No problem. It's all right. Let me tell her to quickly prepare. Please do. Oh? Do. Mom, that you're pregnant. Have you spoken to Charles? Have you gotten him on the phone? Because I know you have been calling him. Mama. I've, I've been calling him, but his number has not been connecting. I don't know whether he changed his line or something. Hey! Welcome back to the new Kowara. I would have said, let's tell the chair, Silas. Mm. Your father is of the opinion that it shouldn't be so. That you shouldn't go there. That they should come here instead. No, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I am just confused. <laughs> oh! I don't want to believe my enemies at work. Eh? I don't want to believe it. Let's see how things go. But I would have said, let's tell it here, Silas. Eh? But from the look of things, I don't think he had talked to his son. If not, he would have made him to come here since. Is that the solution? Oh, I, mean, I don't know 
I don't know. What, what do we do? Somebody tell me, do I go, do I stay? Should I run, should I wait? What am I gonna do? Hey, yeah, hey. Oh, dear, do you wanna make? I know me with you, Romania. Hey, if there is voice for the voiceless. Come and speak for me. Good morning, my dear. How are you? Have you seen Amala this morning? No, I did not. She could be in her room sleeping. Nah, she's not there. I looked for her in her room. She wasn't there. Probably she stepped out to get something. Eh. Then let me go and start cooking before she comes back. But what could she have gone to pick this early in the morning? You just ask too many questions. Why not wait for her to come? Then you hear from her. No problem. Let me go and start cooking. Thank you. Somebody tell me. Do I go, do I stay? Should I run, should I wait? What am I gonna do? Hey, yeah, hey. Oh, dear, do you wanna make? I know me with you, Romania. Hey, if there is voice for the voiceless. Come and speak for me if there is strength for the weak. Come and fight for me. We'll be our best. Don't worry, don't worry. Um, I don't want to go inside. Yes, sir. Mother, I beg, no problem for trouble. You want me to go back to the Don't worry, I don't want them to know that I'm here. Um, where is your girl? No, that's so. I don't ask you one small question. Since that day where you and Mama follow come up for this compact, I never see you again. What's it happened? Don't worry, that's okay, nothing. It's okay, it's a long story. Is your guy around? Where is he? Madam, that one be under trouble. I never see you, Oga, for the past two weeks. Oga no day this company. I never see him. You've not seen my husband for the past two weeks. I swear. I swear, me say everything said they confuse me. Two weeks. Two weeks. Did he travel? And then, and this question they confuse me the more. Because Oga moved today inside this compound. Though. He moved to pack here. But I never used this my two eyes. See Oga. Madam, you do okay? Uh, yes. Um, no problem. I will come back later. In case my husband comes, tell him that I came. That he should call me. It's very urgent. Like, very, very urgent. Oga? Yes. But I'm no You say I took the ask question. But I want. And you say you did good to me when you did this compound. This uh, you still they live here. It's my husband's house. Uh, you sure? Just tell my husband that I came. Eh, uh, but I come inside, I come with from now. If he No, no, thank you. Yeah? Just keep everywhere, secure everywhere. Yeah? It was my husband come, remind me that I came. He's letting me come very urgent. What can I say? 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 What can I say?
past this long gun. So what do you want? But I'm just in my joy and you're making this life unlivable for me. Man is what you want them tell me about. But I'm I can't believe sorry, that you ask of me to stay. This whole thing doesn't make any sense. You know, you know, you know. What do I do now? And which way to go now? No wonder his number has not been connecting. So he has finally returned to the UK, leaving me here in this village. And now I'm carrying his child. How wicked can he be, oh God? God, please come to my rescue. This is too much for me. Get myself into this mess. Oh, oh, oh. What do I do now? Which way to go now? What can I say? What do I do now? Oh, yeah. It's time I want to be a ton in my flesh. The deal we have in the past is long gone. So, what do you want? You're still in my joy, and you're making this life unlivable for me. If money is what you want, then tell me I will pay. I can't believe that you're asking me to stay. This whole thing doesn't make any sense. You know, you know, you know. What do I do now? And which way to go now? Whoa, yeah. What can I say? What can I do? Oh, what do I do now? I wish we to go now. Oh, no news yet. Hey! What am I going to do now? Hey, Jimo! Hey, hey! calm down! Hi! Calm down! Which one is calm down? How do you mean I should calm down? How am I supposed to sleep in this house without my daughter? What I can I and roll out together? We all slept together! And this morning I couldn't find her, but until this moment she's not here. I'm sure she sneaked to the city to see Charles. Eh? No one could have come here to kidnap our daughter from the house. Eh? Let us wait till the end of the day. Eh? If there's no news, we'll know what next step to take. Right. I don't believe this is your city thing. It's too late for her to come back from the city. What am I going to do? Her phone is not even going. As she said, calm down. I agree it is late. But not too late for someone to come back home. You don't expect someone who has gone to the city to come back just so soon like that. Eh? Calm down. Nice. You see, I don't believe this your city thing. I am so scared. I am so worried. What if something has happened to my daughter? Where are you going? What do I do now? Which way to go now? What can I say? What do I do now? Oh yeah. It's time I want to be a ton in my flesh. The deal we have in the past is long gone. So what do you want? You still in my joy and you're making this life unlivable for me. If money is what you want, then tell me I will pay. I can't believe that you're asking me to stay. This whole thing doesn't make any sense. You know, you know, you know. What do I do now? And which way to go now? Whoa, yeah. What can I say? What can I do? Oh, what do I do now? I wish we to go now. Whoa, 
crashing down on me Everything is falling apart How do I get myself into this mess? Oh, oh, what do I do now? Which way to go now? What can I say? Eat, eat, eat. Nine. You're not saying anything. Young lady, I did not kill my mother. Therefore, you will not kill me. What kind of useless and senseless move was that? If something had happened to you, what would I have done? Huh? You refuse to believe me that this your stubborn daughter has sneaked to the city to see that useless and hopeless boy that refused to, to, to care about her. Eh? Okay, Papa, Mama, I'm very sorry. I did not sneak out though. It's just that I knew that if I had told you, you would not have allowed me to go. So that is why I now sneaked out. <laughs> no problem. Now that you have snuck out to go and see again, what is the good news? Question. The good news is that there's no good news. You see? I met the gate man. I asked him about my husband. He said my husband is not around, that he has not seen him since. But his car is still parked in the compound, meaning that it's like he has traveled out of the country. You see? You see? I forget. You see? Oh. <laughs> so what about the other woman? Mama, I did not ask after her. I was so curious about my husband that I forgot to ask after her. But with the look of things, the house is opened, meaning that someone is there. Maybe she's still inside. I don't know. Amara. Sir? Amara. Sir? Can you not see why I continue to insist that that boy does not care about you? And, and must not know about, about this pregnancy. He needs to know. Eh? He is responsible for the pregnancy. Therefore, he has to know. Ah. Yes. He will only know when he has come to his senses. But with his present condition, no way. He will never set his eyes on my daughter. Why are you washing your hand? Have you eaten? No, I don't like the smell of the food. It's turning my stomach. So what are you going to eat now? Oh, Mama, just make for me indomie with egg. Make the egg two egg. Sandra has been bugging my phones with calls, threatening me. Threatening me, Frank Montello. Ah. You don't give a fuck about no fucking Frank Montello. What the fuck is that? Your manager, I want you about this shit. You got yourself in this fucking shit, man. You got yourself out. Fuck oh, that shit. I'm not scared, bro. I am not scared of her. This is not the first time I'm being threatened by a woman. <laughs> it's not going to be the last time either. Do you understand? Like, she's just missing me. She's showing feelings. Come on. If she's going to bring up something else, she can bring up something else. I'm not threatening me. No one threatens the scorpion. Oh, yeah? I'll stink, you know. Oh, shit. I think you stink. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. <laughs> but I tell you, I see you feeling like a bad guy. But believe me when I tell you, bro, that bitch is gonna come for you. 
And when she does, I don't want you to run into my house like some bitch nigga begging for milk. And you're feeling like a bad guy, calling yourself Scorpion King. <laughs> what the fuck is that? You ain't no Scorpion King, bro. Look, you know, women, I can't, I can't, I can't keep all the sugar for her. Come on. I need to share the sugar. She can have me. Sandra, it's old school. She's in the past. She's past tense. I need to move on. I need to share this around. I need to share what my mama gave me, bro. Don't forget that, that bitch. Come on. Give us the fuck. Whatever, whatever, bro. Don't forget that, bro. I'm broke right now. I need some money. I need some real deal. Something new. Come on. You see the reason why you're broke? Because you're busy sharing sugar. Instead of making money. Fuck that, man, nigga. You need to... What the fuck is you doing? Bro, you need to make money. You're busy going all over the place sharing sugar. What the fuck does that? You ain't no real gangster. Back in the state, man, we don't share no sugar. We go for fucking money. You fuck with my money, I mess you up. That's what's up. Nigga, you gotta go back to that bitch. Believe me when I tell you. Yo, if you wanna get some money, you go back to that bitch. Else, my nigga, you going back to your village. I don't give a fuck out that does. I need to make this clear to you. Sandra is past tense. I have moved on with my life. Come on, come on, bro. I need some real deal. We're, we're gonna be talking about women here. Is that, is that what we came here to do? And I'm gonna make it clear to you. Your ass is going broke. We're going back to the village, bro. We're going back to the projects. I still have you, bro. You ain't got me. Yo, my nigga, you ain't got me. I got, I got, I got shit to take care of. You got me to take care of, bro. I got shit to take care of, man. You got me to take care of, bro. I got you to take care of. You're a fucking man, man. Babe, why are you so concerned about this Frank? Are you in love with him or something? Listen, babe, you will not understand. Seriously. I only miss him in bed and that's it. Trust me, Frank knows how to hit the juice water. He knows how to, you know, do the right things at the right time. That's just it. Now I know my friend's problem. But you can always get other men to do the same thing. I mean, you can get men that would satisfy you and equally pay you, even in hard currency. Oh, please. Those men can never be like Frank. It's not possible. Yes, I know this guy ran away with my money, but look at me. I'm not even bothered about it. I just want to see him. And I will not have Frank dump me. Instead of me dumping him, I won't. I just want him, period. You know what? I'm going to introduce you to real men. Hello, Alaji. I'm fine. How are you doing? Alaji, if you can add something to what you normally give me. I have this foreign breed I'm going to bring to you and you will thank me later. <laughs> Alhaji, trust me. This one is out of this world. Okay, um, Alhaji, if you add 500,000 extra to what you normally give me, I'll bring her to you, yes. Okay. Thank you very much, Alaji. And what do you think you're trying to do? Wait a minute. Are you trying to pick me to... I do not care what you think. I just want my friend to satisfy herself, enjoy yourself, and in return, make cool cash. Don't worry, you will thank me later. You know, you are so unbelievable. Thank you later for some what? Some old, average, I mean, aged pig. The last time I, I remember, you introduced me to some chief who could not even wake up an ordinary bit. I mean, he could not even do it, Jack. He kept snobbing. Here you are, you want to introduce... What does an allergy even know about 
satisfying and hitting the right spot at the right time. Down below. What does Alaji know? Just you see what I am saying? You're not understanding me. I just want my fan. Relax. You're going to enjoy this one. He's going to satisfy you. You might even run away. Just relax. Calm down. My Frank. I just want my Frank. It's obvious you cannot get over this Frank. But babe, half bread is better than no. I do not want any half bread. I just want Frank. I want you for the night. Okay, how much do you have? I just mentioned any amount you want. That's 5k per eh? Why? Why would I give you 35k? I don't understand. Why, have you why are you shouting? If I've, wait, let me ask you. Have you asked if I've given my mom 35k? Forget about this. Let me just give you... Uh, let me see. Yo. The party's that way. Did you say the nonsense? I mean... The stupid thing that your friend was dancing with. No, 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 wait. Was he actually doing that to get back at me? No, was he doing it purposely? You know what? Forget about that guy. I'm going to hook you up some other guy. Oh, listen to me, please. This is not about you hooking me up with which other mama or whichever horse I've been. I don't care about them. I am talking about your friend. Listen, your friend just messed up. And I'm a I am going to just fuck up and that's it. What the hell is going on here? I thought you was in love with Charles. And so? What's so up what? with all this Frank shit, man? You know what? I think you should just shut up your mouth. Go back in there and fix the shit with your friend. That's what you should do as a man. I am talking to you. You know what? I think I'm done with this shit. Of course you should be done. Yo, I'm out no, of here. No, you man. should be done. Bye. Look at him. Excuse me? Did you call everybody you say in the club, you retired an idiot? Imp. What? Listen, I have had it up to here with that guy's nonsense. Do you see what he did out there? Babe? I don't think you should do this. Why Just, shouldn't I do Let's it? go back. I have ill feelings about You this. have ill feelings? Yes. I don't think you know anything about ill feelings. Because at this point, I feel so heartbroken. I need to go back and talk to that bitch. Calm down. What do you think will happen if Charles find out you're fighting over another man? Oh. No, this is not the game plan, please. You can get tougher guys to do what Frank is doing. Ah, here she goes again. Maybe you're talking about the last aged idiot you introduced to me that could not even last up to five minutes in bed, right? Just shut it. Excuse me, please. So this fool thought I was going to be traveling out of the country with him. So pathetic. I got my visa ready. Before he knows what's happening, I'll be out of this country. Vera. Babe.
Not a Philip. What's what's going on? Vera. Switched off. What's going on? She should at least listen to me now. I deserve to be hurt. She forgotten our plans already. Like, what is wrong with women? What is wrong with this gender? No. This is the reason I asked you not to go. Now look at the state you're in. If it's I beg you, I just want to be left alone. I beg of you. I've had enough. I mean, what is all this? Charles doesn't want me, Frank does not want me. Babe, do you know how much of my money that guy has been squandering? He sells my goods and sends me peanuts. Do you know how that feels? I don't think so. Maybe I'm in love with this guy. Ugh. It's not about him satisfying you in bed or satisfying your needs. You're obviously in love with this guy. He, that is why you're not even bothered about your millions he's with. But everyone hates me. Frank doesn't like me. Charles doesn't like me. Everyone, everyone hates me. Maybe, uh, it's okay, we... We're going to know how to walk around this. Know how to sort this out. Okay? Just take it easy. Easy, easy. Bro. That's your day, bro. Damn! Vera fooled me. Oh yes, she did. I, I thought we were in love together. I, I never knew I, I was the only one loving her. You know how much I cared for her? I started making preparations for us to travel to Canada. To start up a life with the money and... I never knew she had her own hidden agendas. At the slightest opportunity, she showed me that she is actually the devil in sheep clothing. Fuck shit, bro. You got played. Damn. Oh. So what's you gonna do now? What am I going to do? Nothing. She has esconded with all of the money. I don't even have a dime with me right now. I, I, I don't even know how to face this. I can't find her. I can't trace her. Bro, if you ask me, man, <laughs> this is Nemesis. Obviously. You tried to abscond with Sandra's money. And just from nowhere, there comes like a vulture disappears with the money. Who does that? <laughs> Bro, listen. Sandra trusted you. Yes. She left you in charge of all the business. All her business. You know why? Because she loves you. I, I, I didn't know she really loved me, bro. How was I supposed to know? I thought she was just there for the fun, for the sex, you know? Hell no, she was not. I know I betrayed my friend Charles by keeping him in the dark and supporting Sandra behind his back. But trust me, I will tell you the truth. 
Sandra loves you. You've got to go look for her, man. Apologize. I know she loves you, so she's going to take you back. Yeah. Vera is just not the woman for you. Believe me when I tell you this. I, I know women so well. All right? And if you search your heart, you will see that you love Sandra. Damn. A bitch played you. Fuck. She played me big time, bro. Oh, yeah, she played you big time, bro. I feel, I feel fooled. No, bro, you've been fooled, man. Don't feel fooled. You've been fucking fooled. I... I just... I'm the most confused person on earth right now. <laughs> Nigga, if I was you, I'll kill myself, bro. <laughs> All that money? Gone just like that? Because you want to... Niggas, you about to die in my house? Why don't you listen to me, Sandra? I've beaten more than you can chew. You've pushed me to the wall, I'll tell you one thing. You can take back your contract. Take everything that you have offered me. I cannot trade my family for anything. You have done more than enough. I know why I kept quiet all this while. But you see now, you have proven yourself more than a tantrum on my flesh. I don't want to meet you in my house. I cannot trade my family for anything and you have done more than enough. If you humiliated my wife, you've made me a, a mockery in my, my family. Stay away from me, Sandra. Before I get to that house, I do not want to meet you there. Do not say I didn't want you. Do not say I did not want you. You can take back the contract. Take back everything that you gave to me. Take back, take back your life and leave mine alone. I won't want you again. I won't want you again. I said, where is she? She. Here. Come for me. No woman don't ever find me come this house. So. For this gate, no woman don't enter this compass. It's where you travel, Oga. No woman don't come this house. I, I swear. Uh. See you close. Hmm? I'm not joking with you. I will ask you for the last time. Where is she? Oga, for where are one? Oga, so you don't trust me for how many years? No woman come this house. Uh. Where? It's Sandra. Where is she? Madam Sandra. Oga, since how many weeks where you travel? No woman don't come here. I never see madam. Nobody, nobody don't come this house. No leave me day, no leave me day this house. I swear, no leave me day. No leave me day here for morning to night. No leave me day day. You listen to me, sir, I'll be home. I know that so. The other madam didn't come. No me ask me she did forget to. I've been beg and beg and beg and beg and so tell even me I won't cry. Trust me, she come inside. Make she come wait for you. She no agree. Now the big That's your cross. That's enough. I'll go back to your duty post. Sorry, sir. Sandra, you have woken up the beast in me. The battle line is drawn. It is time to sort this out once and for all. Oh. 
Yo, what's up, man? For real? You back, bro? Oh, 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 man. Oh, I'll be coming to see you right away, all right? Oh. I think it's time, bro. Yo, um, bro, listen, um, see, I've been meaning to talk to you about something very serious. You've been my very good friend for a very long time. As a matter of fact, you're a brother to me. So I think I should open up. What are you talking about? Okay. Um, you see, um, I've been doing some deals with with Sandra. I don't understand. What are you talking about? I've been doing some business with Sandra. Yes, making some money. As a matter of fact, I got her involved with some guy who now do business with. And, um, you know, once in a while, get down <laughs> like that. <sighs> well, this is the reason why she's been comfortable in this country. And as a matter of fact, I do not think she's planning to go back anytime soon. Why? I don't know. But I think she's in love with this guy. From the way I see things. Yeah. They in love. I'm, I'm truly sorry about that. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so very much. What? Is this what you call open up? You thought I was supposed to be here. Did I overreact? <laughs> Pardon me, my friend. I'll, ha, ha, I can I can control the excitement. It's uh, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Uh, say, brother. <laughs> Hold on, bro. Are you not mad at me? I beg your pardon. You are my savior. You just saved a brother, man. You know what it means to get a Rottweiler out of my house? Out of my life? Completely? Really? You don't know? I should be calling you life saver. Life saver. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Here's what you should do for a brother, huh? Help me facilitate or, you know, hasten up the wedding. Let it come through as soon as possible. Make it real quick. Real quick. <laughs> now I should be feeling like a savior. You should. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what can I get you? Well, I want you to get me everything you've got, bro. <laughs> everything coming through. Coming through, <laughs> bro. <laughs> My savior. Yo. Papa, I am sorry. I'm truly sorry for everything that happened. You see, it's not my intention to bring sadness or chaos to this family. But I'll tell you one, one truth, Papa. Papa, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for, for the shame I brought this family Sorry for everything. I regret everything that has happened this period. This phase of my life is, is the worst I've ever experienced since I became a man. It's been tough. It's been rough. But Papa, I want to let you know that 
I've sorted everything out. I want my wife back. Once again, Papa, I am deeply sorry. <clears throat> well, son, you know I don't have a problem with you here. But you have to tell this to your in-laws. Yes. With your actions, you brought disgrace to this family. But you gave more to your in-laws. You're very correct, Papa. I brought shame to my own family. But I'm sorry. One thing I promise you is that this will never repeat itself. Never. Huh? I hope so. Please, Papa, can you accompany me to my in-laws' place? I'm sure with your presence, things will not be that difficult. But I really, really want my wife back. So now you know you have a wife. Yes. Well, it's okay. I, I had a contract with a company that offered me over 200 million naira. A little did I know that it was Sandra who submitted my name to the company and found out that the uncle has affiliation with the company. As a matter of fact, he's a friend to the CEO of the company. And that's how I got the contract. But I never knew that Sandra had an ulterior motive that if she helps me to get the contract, I must marry her. And so, and I, instead of losing my wife, the one I love, I decided to give up the contract. But behold, the company called me and my contract was intact. That is why I've been away for some time now. So I went to fix it, and I am back. I am back for my love. <coughs> my in-laws, please accept us back and forgive. You have heard his explanations, and that is the truth. We are glad that the enemy that has come to kill, to steal, and to destroy has been finally put to shame. Though I'm not happy that my daughter is still in my house, but I've heard his explanation. I just hope he's saying the truth. I am saying the truth. Nothing but the truth. Are you giving me your words? My words, my bond. Never feel you again, sir. Then, it is all settled. I am sorry for everything that happened. At that point in time, no one will understand me. No one would understand my plight and what I was going through at that time. Where is Sandra now? I don't know. And I don't care. And I'll be ready for her whenever she comes back. But the good news 
Is that the biggest contract I have ever worked for? Chief X Limited is sealed. And we're relocating to the UK. Yes. Relocating to the UK. As soon as we get back to the city, I'll fix your documents so you can travel with me. You have no idea. Seeing you in this condition is, is everything to me. I love you. You know, Charles, when you left, peace of you still remains with me. I never stopped thinking about you. I know. But this time around, all of me will always be with you. Promise me you won't do this again. Like, leave me all to myself again. I promise. I'll never leave you again. I'm sorry. I am so happy. So happy that everything is now resolved. Mm -hmm. My daughter, mm -hmm. you can now go back to your husband's house. I have saved delivery under his roof. What? Eh? Mm -hmm. Do you know, I am happier. Because my enemies will not have mouths again to laugh at me. <laughs> They've all been put to shame collectively and individually. That's true. Eh? That's true. You see, this is my first move. I will so prepare well that this entire community will stand still. Mama, Mama, please stop. You and this your move thing. Uh uh. Hey. Oh, I don't call you when I call you an uncle. Mazukoni, Ebony, because now watch. <laughs> I've got my first achievement. <laughs> the devil has been put to shame. So also all my enemies. They have been put to shame. Cover their faces in shame. Uh, so, my daughter. You have to behave yourself. Hmm? Minus what happened, and for the fact that we all misunderstood him, he still remains your husband. Mm -hmm. My happiness is that finally both of you have come together. I hope you're listening to what he's saying. I do not want to hear stories again, no. About one one on Neafe, shoot by Mama Fly. I don't want to hear it again. And you suck it down. Eh? Big up, what? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, sorry. Mama, don't worry. I have what you said. There will be no cause for alarm again. Yeah. Everything is resolved now. And I'm happy about it. It's okay. God has taken control of everything. He answered my prayer. Amen. Yeah. Hey. That's it. I'm yeah. Hey, Mama, mm -hmm. my husband told me that we are relocating to the UK. Yeah, and he. <laughs> hey! Hey, wait, don't, 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 don't. Hey, <laughs> eh? so I'm coming to the UK for the Omugwa. But no, I'm not born in Kenya, hey, wait. So I will not come to my first Omugwa. In the UK. Yes, Mama. <laughs> we are going together. How? Yeah. Men do not go for Mugo. Both of us are no, her parents. Don't, don't worry. I will go. When I come, I'll buy you your shina and the other things they will put for you. Oh, yes. Papa and Mama, now you should stop again. Mama, you have not, I've not even gotten to the UK and you're already planning. No, 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 no. It's for good. Yes. He said, yes, you have say it, it will really happen. It's good to dream big. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> if you don't dream big, you ah. will get big. No, for me, no. Ha! 
Especially in your condition. Allow me to do all of that. Hmm? Not for the fact that we are relocating or cutting you a house apart. Since we're living there, we don't need for that with everything you want and now we want for you. Huh? Well, baby, I've been at home since morning. I'm tired. I'm just. I just let me just watch this place like right now. Do you want me to be lazy? No. But at the same time, I want you to have a very good problem last. Huh? I'll be interested. I have a surprise for you. Surprise? <laughs> Tell me, yes. babe. Yes. I, I, I can't guess. What is it? Uh, just try. Okay. Um, 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 your papers are ready and we are leaving in two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Um, but baby, what if we get to overdo you go abroad? Who will be helping me after the living? Of course. What of mama? Can she come? Mama can come, your sister. Anyone, anyone can come. Just tell me who wants to come. I'll get documents ready. And room! Person is right there. Baby! He's sweet to me. He's sweet to me. <laughs> What do men want from women? What exactly do men want? I don't understand. Men and women. <laughs> a man sees a beautiful tall woman And he goes complaining, she lack the will of power. You see a short woman, and you complain, she's short, she's brief, she's not smart, she's not intelligent. What is a perfect woman to the definition of a man? What is it? What is it, oh man? What is the problem? Vera has messed up my life. I failed to realize that I was in love with Sandra. Who oh, Sandra? Sandra? I really miss you. Beautiful Sandra. The only woman that has really complimented me.
How am I going to convince her? How? How would I be able to tell her that she is the love of my life right now? Best woman in my life. Tall, beautiful, hardworking, business oriented. Oh. Look at all the money I have made because of Sandra. Now I've lost it because of Vera. Sandra. Oh, Sandra. 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 I love you, Sandra. I want you back, Sandra. What are you doing here? I said, what are you doing here? Listen, what do you want? Listen, Charles. I'm, what do you want? I'm not here to cause any problem or any harm at all. I'm actually here to tell you that I am sorry. Listen, I know since I came back, I've been of bad behavior and more or less of and more of trouble to you and your family. But please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I am sorry. I am going back to the UK, never to return. I mean, it's obvious I do not have a base here. I actually came back because of you. But I guess nature has its way, you're not for me, so I'll just go back and then. I already reconciled with my uncle, so he's willing to take me back. I guess we're not meant for each other. I just want to say I'm sorry. But please extend my apology to your wife and your mother in law. I'm sorry. I'm also sorry for the pain I must have caused you. I mean to treat you this way. Mm. I won't deny it. I can write my success story without you. You gave me shelter. You gave me a residence permit in the UK. You, you made me a big boy. <laughs> you practically gave me a life. <sighs> what more can I say? I'm sorry. I wish I wish I could turn back the hands of time. Unfortunately, this wasn't part of the plan. All the same, I want you to know that in me, you have found a friend. In me, you found a family. I'll always be there for you. Anytime you need me, do not hesitate to let me know. It's painful. It hurts. We just have to say goodbye for now. Be good. One, one more thing. Thanks for the contract. Congratulations. Good. One. You're still my best friend. Oh, dear. So Every day I'm crying. Every day I'm shedding tears. 
Somebody tell me, do I go? Do I stay? Should I run? Should I wait? Yes, sis. Come on, Fritz. What am I doing here? I mean, it's better for me to just go back. Charles is married to another woman. Frank does not even want me. So I think it's best for me to leave. Besides, you can always come back anytime and then we'll see what's there. But I'm here for you, darling. Yes, that I know. But trust me, you, you will not understand. I need some time to clear my head and then just cool off. I'm sure I'll be fine. Okay, I I really miss you. I know. Mm. That's your problem. <laughs> I'll come back soon. Take care of yourself. Okay, I will. So, time right to hit the door. Frank, what the hell are you doing here? I, I, I am sorry. I came to apologize to you. Please. I, I know I've caused you a lot of pains and trouble. But after looking at the whole situation, I discovered you're not the only one who is guilty of falling in love. I am also in love with you. I am so much in love with you. There is a lot of things in common between you and I. And I strongly believe that we can work things out. That is, if you are still interested in us. Fine, I, I am sorry. I'm sorry about your money. Vera made away with everything. And I know her karma will catch up with her too. But look, I am a changed person right now. I truly love you. I am willing to do anything, anything, anything to make up for everything I have done to you. Please. 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 So, Johnny cancelled. Should I take your box inside? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> no way. You're going with me. You're not going to... You're not staying here. No. Not again. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. You are such a drama queen. No. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, guys. Um... <laughs> Sorry, I'll, I'll be too selfish. Now. Nah, you're so oh, selfish. Course, you know, so feel free, feel free. Feel free. <laughs> we should have started right. with the video. Yes. True, this bro. nigga doesn't give a fuck about it. I, 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 no, I give a fuck, bro. No, Come you on. You, you can't do me like that. No, right? you don't. You should be late. It's obvious right now. It's obvious. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Queen of UK. No, no, no. You don't give me that. Please, add up. Oh, you want more? Yeah, baby. Oh, Over there, we drink a lot. Thank you. Here we go. Hey, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, this is for me. <laughs> so, guys, don't make us jealous, please. So, um, I want to make a toast to freedom for my real G. <laughs> you know how we do. Freedom. <laughs> oh yes. Huh, don't worry, nice. you won't understand. I do. And um, I want to make another toast for all the successful businesses I have done. It's the real queen of UK herself. <laughs> and also another toast to the new face of love. Aww. That 
we are all experiencing. <laughs> Say that again. So, guys, oh, cheers. 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 Nice guy. This guy is good. I know. Yeah, I. Know. Wow. <laughs> All thanks to my, my real plug. Oh, ooh, Kubana. <laughs> oh, ooh. Yo, he's my, he's my supplier. Just a ooh. Just a ooh. Just a ooh. Okay, guys, I actually wanted to use this medium to. I actually wanted to use this medium to apologize to you. I know I've not been good. I've not been nice. But trust me, if you ask your husband and he knows me, that wasn't me at all. I was just carried away. Please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm feeling so emotional right now. <laughs> um, Sandra, I've actually forgiven you before you asked. Really? Yes. Aww. <laughs> That's the spirit. That's the spirit. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. <laughs> oh. Words. Words are not enough. I'm happy. I'm happy that this, this is happening. I mean, it's been a long time. It's been war, war, war. But for the very first time, we have peace. We have happiness. So I'd say cheers to happiness. Mm. Cheers. To happiness. Cheers, bro. Cheers, cheers. 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 To happiness. Cheers. And more cheers. And more cheers. <laughs> <laughs> to happiness. Yeah. yeah. To happiness. Mm. More business. More business. More business. More, more business. Wine. But I think you guys are not noticing something. What? I mean, every other person is a woman, right? Uh huh. But from some people. Yeah. So I think my friend Miguel here is actually. <coughs> I also think I have a single friend who doesn't want to be hooked up. It doesn't, doesn't look like he has a choice tonight. Two couples here, you know, some people need to actually link up this way. Mm -hmm. And I think I am on this way. My best friend that I have. Oh my ladies, okay? <laughs> <laughs> hey Mark, what's up? Um I'm sure you already know my name. <laughs> I see. Right, 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 right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> now we dare say to know music. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. Don't get me drunk. Oh no, I'm not trying to get you drunk. I'm just um okay. trying to make sure you <laughs> have enough. I'm um, with your AC card. So what's up? <laughs> you actually look good. Thank you. And I'm going to love you, right? Oh. Do I 